I'm bringing up, baby. What the f are we doing this? Didn't they watch it? Frank is finally back after being gone for three weeks. Frank is my living bodyguard and also my favorite person in the world. I love Frank. Tell him what you've been up to, Dan. Like the night she snuck out of the house. You want to act up? He's gone. My mom gets on my nerves. Hey, Frank has to leave for good. I don't know what I would do. I'm about to just go. Where's she going? I need to get stuff for Frank's birthday. I figured I'd make dinner, why not? Can you come grab me? And I need to get because it's Frank's birthday. Can you please just come get me? She has to do what? Drew's gonna come get me. Come on. She just thinks she could do whatever the she wants. Bernie and Drew work for Warner. You know where you're going? Watch out for this guy. Bruh. Drew is the troublemaker. You want to kill him, but you'd feel bad if you did. That's a really good explanation of Drew. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Drew. Brittany's my best friend. Any questions I ever have, this bitch. <laughs> like a bitch. Yeah, bitch. If you leave it to Danielle, nobody does their job. Like, she fires all of us at least once a day. <laughs> so what is it that you want to get from the store? I just want to get some food to cook for tonight. I ain't never seen Danny cook. I know how to make like rice and beans and like chicken. Bro, rice you just boil it and beans you just boil it. <laughs> it's just some chicken and beans and rice. Like we don't gotta be doing all that. You're trying to make me sound dumb like cause I'm white. I don't know how to cook. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, I'm racist? It's enough? No. I'm not a five star chef. Where's the seasoning? But I know how to like make regular things. Four dollars. <laughs> Well, at least I know you know how to budget. Oh, they're 99 cents. That's all. <laughs> All right, see you a little badass later. Bye, All right, bye, Lou. Love you. I'll see you later. I haven't seen Frank in a long time, so I decided to get him something for his birthday. I got you something. I didn't rap it or nothing. You know me. <laughs> this is how you rap? I do Danny's security. That's my title. I'm her living bodyguard. Oh, you got me a real gift. <laughs> This is the only gift I got for my birthday, you know that? Yeah, these are perfect. The truth is, she's kind of become one of my kids. Don't ever say I ain't get your ass nothing. <laughs> His last birthday, I told him, F you, I don't give a f that it's your birthday. Because we were fighting. <laughs> I think you're making up for the last birthday, two Father's <laughs> Day. I don't want to do this. A bunch of holidays. Listen. Well, what are you making, anyways? I don't know. She's what making, chi no, she's she's making right. chicken. She's Wait, making she chicken. Wait, she making or are you oh, making? Oh no, she's making the chicken. I don't want to make the chicken. Can you do it? And can we just pretend like I did it? No. The beets, I love those. <laughs> this meal is gonna be way more to no, for my birthday than that. Can we do something else? Nope. I'm hungry. What do you mean you don't want to do this? So she bought all this food and decided she didn't want to cook. So I ended up having to cook. I just want everybody to know Danny didn't make this meal. So when she takes credit for this meal, she didn't make it. At the end of the day, she's still just a kid. Is it ready? Actually, it is. And she's a spoiled little brat. If my mom's gonna give me attitude, I'm not gonna eat her bullshit ass food. I'm not eating this. She wants to say she's doing something so she can call me ungrateful at the end of the day. Growing up, we had respect for our parents. You're crazy. I'm here letting you live your dream. A once in a lifetime dream. I sit in this house, well, I let you go to the studio and do what you gotta do for your goal and for your career. I'm sorry, is my mother working in the studio every day? Is my mother doing rehearsals? Is my mother doing shows? You can do whatever the f you want. That's the crazy thing about this. You can go wherever the hell you want, be with whoever you wanna be with, go do whatever you wanna do. I don't care, you want a car, I will get you one. You want another house party for me, I will get you two of them. I don't care if it's her money, I'm the f boss. Just stop being so annoying and harping on the same being so annoying or stop parenting. There's a difference. You don't get it. That's my job. You're 15. Job. Yeah, you don't run sense. your own life. When I'm 18, I'm not going to be an asshole about it. But once 11 o'clock hits, we're going to start packing. And once 12 o'clock hits, you're out. What you do is what you do, and what she does is what she does, okay? Whatever is right or wrong in her personal life is her issue, especially being the parent and being older. Frank, he gets involved too much. Part of what she's saying is right. Really? I don't tell you how to parent your child. Don't step in and parent my child. There might be people giving their opinions, but they don't make a 
decision. At the end of the day, there's only one person that's not replaceable, and that's me. Sick of all the Next song, bring it up, baby. Buy my money, buy these bands, your pockets in the drought. I make it hits, bitch. Hello? Is she getting on the phone? Who's coming? I invited people. It's hard for her to maintain friendships. If they come, they come. If they don't, they don't. What happens when that female gets mad and every secret I've told her is now all over TMZ? I'm better off being alone.